It's the big political story we're tracking today. It's the most direct attack on the Congress President Sonia Gandhi by party old guard. H.R. Bharadwaj, the former law minister, has lampooned the party chief. He claims that the second leaders of the Congress are being humiliated and thrown out of the party. Bharadwaj says that Sonia Gandhi takes no responsibility. He blames her for no inner democracy within the party. Bharadwaj says that the Congress has been hijacked by psychophants. He also uh, mocked the Gandhi sign and rooted for Priyanka Gandhi to join politics. What is my question of being happy or unhappy? We are no more in contact and I don't propose to go near him. Because she herself removed me from parliament. Where is conduct? Are there any, is there any inner democracy? Is there any election of the party at any level, primary level or the highest level? They are by nominations. So in no democracy, Congress is in grip of a couple of psychophants and corrupt people. I know nothing about him. I got, filed his nomination only. After that, we never talked. Why blame him? He is no position. He is simply one vice president. What is he? He was unnecessary put in the difficulty in Lok Sabha election. Party should move in the election, general election. Party did not move. It was a walkover given uh, by the Congress. But a dukhi baat hai. कि हमारे नेताओं को कोर्टों में समन हो रहे हैं और शीर्षस्थ प्राइम मिनिस्टर लेवल के भी तो सोनिया गांधी को नहीं दिखता ये कि क्या हो गया और क्यों हो गया और किसने करवा दिया सब कुछ मालूम है डेट इज आर स्टाइल शेयरिंग नो रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी एंड येट डू एवरीथिंग आई नो पर्सनली दिस वॉज राजाज मिनिस्ट्री विच amended this IT provision along with other amendments and uh, nothing to do. If I was in the cabinet, I must have also participated in the cabinet. But move to amend was initiated by this DMK minister. They were apprehending something appearing in the Facebook or somewhere. So in order to curb that, at a preventive measure this was done. I don't exactly remember what it was and up for five years it was used. I see no, no dearth of democracy sometimes, maybe there's too much democracy. I see no dearth of democracy in our party. We seem to be scrutinized for democracy much more than any other party in this country is scrutinized for democracy. Uh, secondly, uh, of this word humiliation for anyone, I. I'm a little, uh, I'm, I'm a little uncomfortable with it. Um, we seem to feel a humiliation at, uh, at the, uh, the pressing of a button. Uh, I don't think so. I think life is, is, is too complicated and too full of things for us to pick out one little incident and say we feel humiliated. Of course there are disappointments, sometimes deep disappointments, but uh, at the end of the day there is a lot more that we get. Uh, to overcome those disappointments and I can say categorically uh, that there are many people who are very happy in the party. Headlines today's Ashar Khan uh, joins me live for more on this story. Ashar, this is a hugely embarrassing situation for the Congress party. Uh, does the voice of HR uh, Bharadwaj, Bharadwaj in a certain sense represent that of uh, the silent minority, the silent majority, I beg your pardon? Well, uh, there is a sizable section within the Congress who feels on the lines of which HR Bhardwaj is feeling. Now, uh, this uh, sizable section has a lot of future also with them. While at the moment, uh, HR Bhardwaj, the former law minister and the former governor of Karnataka, is uh, well into his 80s. But uh, the other leaders really have a long career in uh, front of them. That is why perhaps they are not speaking out uh, so, uh, so rapidly. While on the other hand, also, Perhaps the views of HR Bhardwaj are slightly on the extreme side compared to the other views who are on the other side within the Congress party. But yes, uh, this, this is something which has been brewing beneath for a very long time right. and it, it is a fight which is going on between the old guard and the new guard of the Congress party.
All right, it's a fight that's been going on between the old guard and the new guard of the Congress party. HR Bharadwaj there coming out and attacking Sonia Gandhi. It's been the most direct and scathing attack on the Congress uh, president yet from a party member. Asher Ahmed Khan, appreciate you joining us with those details.